Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Laura. Thank you so very much for joining me today. I know it's been a while since I've posted a video, but I have still been crafting. Um, so I started on this project after I got this beautiful, beautiful image, and it is from Patty Lang at Sacred Mementos here on YouTube. I will have her link down below in the description box. And this image is just so beautiful. So I knew that I wanted to make a needle or stick pin book with it. And I will probably make more in the future because it's just so lovely. But um, so I started out with this really beautiful lace here from Crafting Me Shop. And it is like a blush, satiny, shimmery color. And it's sold by the yard. And it's just so pretty. And I use this lace here. This is some that we got in our DT package the last time. Um, I used that to go around the top. And um, it goes all the way around. And I did use another piece of CMS lace um, underneath here, just underneath the image a little bit. But I used her beautiful, beautiful um, rose applique here and this flower is from my own stash but that's another piece of that applique and this here is one of her beaded centers and I added another one over here they're so cute I love those and that's another little piece of that same applique I don't have very much of these left I think actually I think this is my last one but this is a cut one so it's actually pretty big it's missing a piece though so um so what I did was I put another little piece here and there's another applique under here which is this one here and all I did was I just used a part of this top and I used I cut this bottom part here off and so um, that's underneath that beautiful bow and that bow comes in different colors here's a pink one so cute love them and so I also used her um, ruffle trim which is this one here and when you buy this it's it's four layers but I'm running low on trim so I just cut off a piece of this to add around the image and I think it looks so pretty so that is the front Oh, and I forgot to mention this beaded trim here goes all the way around as well. And it's this trim right here. It's absolutely beautiful, beautiful trim. And so the inside, I have another one of those beautiful images. And I added an earring. I sewed that on and I added this bling piece here for her necklace and I added some more for her hair and this white applique is from my own stash but I added her centers here and you can put stick pins in here in the, in the image as well but I just put them on the sides and this is just some stick pins I've been having and I just put them in here I didn't make those but I did make all of the other ones and so I started out with the same lace on the inside, but I used some CMS lace um, all across the front here. And the lace is big in the middle, and it's, it goes slim in this, on the sides, but I forgot to grab that lace. I, I don't even think I have that much of it left, but um, it's so, so beautiful. I love this lace. It's gorgeous. I know it's kind of hard to see it, but um, it's just so pretty. And so, I used this trim, this trim here, and I'm not sure where I got this lace trim at. It might be from Crafty Me Shop, but I really don't remember. I don't want to say it is if it's not, but um, that was all I had left of it, and I just took the pieces I had left and put them on the top here. And this scallop trim here is from her shop, and it's this one here. It's very beautiful. And so, I added it on the bottom and in the center here. 
I thought it would frame that image really well. And so I used the same trim on the cover um, here in the middle. And I used these really beautiful appliques. She always has these. And this is what they look like. But I added some felt behind them. And um, I just love these. Aren't these adorable? And so in the middle of those, I cut these flowers out and added them in the middle. And I cut these beads off. I know you're probably like, what? She cut that applique, but guess what? I always use the whole thing. Um, but anyway, so I cut the beads off and I just put a pearl center in the middle. And so on these, on this scallop trim here, I added these beautiful little flowers. They're kind of hard to see. But they're really beautiful. They're from her shop as well. I've been hoarding them. But this is a close-up. And yeah, I just I think it turned out so very pretty. I love how the bling in the image just makes it pop. And it just, you know, looks so beautiful. I don't know if you can see the stick pins, but it's uh one of them's got a heart. And over here, I have another one with a heart. And I have an angel one here. And I forgot to mention that this trim all around the top and the sides, that is from my own stash. Um, but, yeah, I hope that y'all like this. Please leave me a comment down below if you do. I would love to hear what you think about it. And um, like always, I appreciate all of your comments and all of your likes. That makes me feel so good whenever people leave me comments, you know, because I work hard on my projects. I take my time and I try to make one of a kind items. Um, and so it just really brightens my day to see your comments. Um, so I thank y'all so very much for watching and I will be back soon with another project share. Hopefully not in two weeks. Hopefully it'll be sooner. Um, so y'all just have a wonderful day. And just thank y'all so very much for watching. Bye.